Hey, what's up coders? Welcome to One Little Coder. Mid Journey V5, the version 5 of Mid Journey can really do fingers much, much better, but it is not exactly where it want we want it to be. So it's almost good to be the perfect finger maker because AI pictures, one of the easiest ways for you to identify AI pictures is to look at the fingers and most of the fingers are like, you know, wiggly wobbly, like it's, it's all over the place. But Mid Journey V5 is really good at making fingers. But is it the best? Definitely not, but it does its job. And in this video, I would like to show you my finger experiments, my finger experiments with mid journey V5, what worked, what did not work. So what can you do about it so that your pictures will have really good fingers to start with? I would like to show you this picture. So this is a, a the portrait. Uh, this is a prompt where I said close up photo of a samurai warrior holding a sword, focus on hand holding the sword. So I got four images. One image did not have the right set of fingers, like it had only three. So the like the way that I'm thinking is, for example, if I'm holding something, so if I'm holding something like this, the four fingers should be visible. Maybe the thumb is visible or not. So that's what I was expecting. So you you can assume that the thumb is not visible, like if I'm holding something. So at least the four fingers should be there. So I got out of four images, three images with uh, the four fingers. And uh, this is the image that I actually like. The sword is really nice. It looked like a warrior. I felt this is the most perfect image that I could make with uh, mid journey V5. But very surprisingly, one of uh, like I got a command a comment from uh, Twitter saying that uh, the samurai period started in this time, the soldiers began wearing wedding rings around this time. So having a wedding ring here makes this picture not a samurai picture. So even though this video is about fingers, I would like to highlight this fact that during multiple of my trials, I found that a lot of times when you ask for finger, especially adult fingers, you see wedding ring. I'm not sure if it is that Western influence or the data set that they've got almost always has ring. And you can perfectly see in this picture also, which, you know, Andreas rightly pointed out that this does not represent samurai. I think I am quite happy that still there are some cues to identify that this is an AI generated image, but this is something for you to keep in mind that while you're dealing with fingers, Wedding ring is going to be a thing with mid journey five because I've been seeing a lot of wedding rings in a lot of instances. Having said that, now let us look at how fingers used to look in V3. So in V3, so the prompt here is I think a hand of a young mo woman holding a soft cotton ball. Okay. So this is the hand. This is the hand that was holding soft cotton ball. That is what it was in V3. But now when I do the same exact prompt in V5, this is what I get. So in out of four images, you can see one has four fingers quite bad. The other one has good, good, good. But one thing that you would always notice with fingers is the plasticky fingers. Like look at this thing. It doesn't have that realistic skill tone. Like you can see, like when you see human hand, you can actually see, you know, all these things, like all these, all these um, things that make a human hand like fingers finger. But this one is like too plasticky. But again, in terms of count, um, it's quite good. Like there is no mutilation. So it is quite good in terms of the count. So in some instances you can even like see the nails, but it's a huge upgrade. Like if you see the V3 and V5, which we have got access to, it's quite amazing. And same prompt, different seed. The cotton ball is quite good. Like this picture is really good in terms of how it looks. Uh, like when you see this is again, good, but the finger position is slightly awkward, but the picture is okay. But again, you can see the plasticky edge, like you can see here, right? When you zoom in, you can see like the nails um, are almost not like if you see human nails, like I have like actually long nails right now, but you can see how it looks. So it's not like the most perfect again, but you can see in out of four images, you will always hit one image that does fingers well. Now the other instances where I found fingers doing good is when you look at pictures like this where you do not necessarily specify that you want hands, but when you just look for like a picture, you can see like there are instances where the fingers is really good. Like it, it actually matches with the skin tone. Like if you see for this person, it matches the skin tone. It looks really good, but there are other fingers. Like you can see in the background, like this finger may not be perfect, but you can see this is a huge improvement in, I think in any uh, out of box, model that can generate images because even in stable diffusion, if you want to generate fingers, you have to use control net and you have to do a lot of things. But here, this is completely out of box and you can see fingers. Same, same kind of image. And you see public photos, 
some the the subject that is focused in the picture you can see the fingers for the subject that is focused the fingers are good and uh, the subjects that are out of focus you can see their fingers like fingers and faces sometimes to be too bad and uh, this is another prompt that i tried um particularly this with this will close the video which is cinematic photo of a young blonde kid with uh, hand waving now when i see this picture in every single picture the fingers are almost perfect you can see the fingers are almost almost perfect you can see the fingers are almost perfect but what was a little concerning for me i am not really sure how midjourney v5 is handling picture or at least fingers i recently covered a video where i said like samsung phones when you zoom into the moon it actually recognizes moon so that it takes a lower resolution image of a moon and then makes a higher resolution image and then overlays it so i said maybe it's not the realistic moon i get a same feeling here i'm not again like i'm completely speculating i get a same feeling here it almost looks like they look for finger um, hand or palm in a picture and uh, looks like they are doing some kind of post processing there or i don't know if the model is actually doing fingers here so i am not able to like at least i i couldn't comprehend or i couldn't distinguish whether the model the ai model the model that they've got v5 can do fingers or this is part of the post processing that happens after the model has generated an image so i am i'm not quite sure what is happening here but it can do fingers but in certain instances like it looks completely unnatural like this fingers the like the palm doesn't doesn't look good to me but this one looks good so overall if you see what is like what is the objective of this video mid journey can do fingers i think there was a there was a tweet everybody was uh, like so mad about it like so it it just said 100 hands waving at the haters and you can see that it is doing like you can see lot of fingers uh, but there are instances where the fingers are quite bad as well but you can see generally mid journey can do fingers much better than anything else but it's quite important for us to pay attention because when you don't pay attention you will see instances like this it almost looks perfect here but you can see here there are two fingers coming in like if you if you close like this this is like two fingers like this and this is not perfect so it's a, it's a fine line between being perfect and being imperfect and also the problem is the skin tone matching with the entire hand and body skin um and being too plasticky but overall am i impressed i'm super impressed with the way the fingers are handled the hand is handled in mid journey v5 i think out of all the models out there without uh, you know doing control net without doing all these things this is probably the best option to come up with really full picture with fingers not um, being mutilated or you know you have got like 10 fingers in one hand so overall mid journey v5 can actually do fingers but almost perfect it's not there it but it is taking us to the place where we would want ai fingers to be sometimes i'm quite actually happy that you know there are some things that this cannot do well because you can look at a picture and then immediately say mm, this is probably ai generated image like i always look for eyeballs and i always look for fingers so looks like i cannot look for fingers anymore i i hope this video was helpful to you in learning how mid journey v5 is handling fingers if you have any question let me know in the comment section otherwise i would love to hear your feedback about what do you feel about mid journey v point v5 see you in another video happy prompting